Last night it rained quite a bit, so the fields are pretty dark and wet. Uh, there's some equipment things we could fix, but there's been a project I've wanted to work on for a little bit. There's like a two acre patch in our house lot that I wanted to clear off and get cleaned up so we can plant it so I don't have to mow it because <laughs> I hate mowing. Well, I just don't do it. I just don't mow. So what we're going to do today, there's a huge pile of trees from last year when we cleared the lot sitting on it. So we're going to burn the pile. Then I'm going to try to clear some trees off. There's a few more trees standing that I need to get a loader in there and knock them over. So I got my kindling all my seed bags from this year and some from last year that we never cleaned up. So I'm doing double duty today. I'm cleaning the barn and burning a pile. Got all the seed bags and kindling on the pile. So now it's time to torch it off. Hopefully we don't get the fire department called on us. Come on baby. You can do it. I need a blowtorch. Now she's going. Are you hungry for a pizza box? How about another seed bag? Ooh. How about several seed bags? Since you're such a good fire. Good little fire. Nally, what are you doing over there? Hunting? Hunting for the wabbits? Big hunting dog. Oh yeah, we're going now. We got fire. We're sitting on our toolbox on the truck with our feet up. That's not good. Not good for you. You'll get be a little more squirrely then. Do you like fire, huh? Are you a little pyro? Yes, Nelly's a pyro. Well, oh, I think we're golden. We're really ripping now. Boy, when that whole pile goes up, it's gonna be like that tall sitting a good like 50 feet away from this thing and I bet it's got to be 100 degrees where we're sitting I can feel it on my face like it feels like I'm sitting in front of a wood stove oh boy now the wind's really whipping around here ah, look at the fire that's awesome look at those flames that is just relaxing right there do you like laying on the toolbox Nelly yeah I think we lost her Let's do CPR. Nelly, are you alive? Oh, you are alive. Amazing. What a rough life you have. And an hour and 15 minutes later, that's all that's left. Dad, Dad when the fire was big, it burned the pile of sticks down. Did it really? Yeah. Steer and push up the pile so everything gets burned. Like these logs over here didn't get burned. Good morning. I am headed to the field right now to do something that I like to call panic spraying. Yes, that's rain on the windows. I knew it was supposed to rain this morning, but I didn't think it was supposed to rain until like 8. I hear rain hitting the roof of the house this morning, and I'm like, oh, shoot. I have like 15 acres of beans that if I don't spray them right now, they're going to emerge. If they are emerged, I'll kill the beans. That would not be good. So I'm taking a page out of my friend Rodman's book. The other day he texted me and said he was panic spraying because he has cover crops that he has to kill. Wish me luck. that up and then mow that lot there next to where we burned the pile yesterday. 
get the weeds knocked down so that we can get it ripped up next week. turn it on and make sure it's gonna work. She's a little grumpy. I think that's just the blade hitting the side wall. I don't remember doing that before. Oh wait, actually, I lied. I think it, it did do that before. fix it or do I use it? I'm just gonna use it. It's not gonna hurt it. Things a hundred years old. Things older than me. Let's just mow a little around here to make sure it's not like gonna co totally collapse. Too low, way too high. All right, it's working. Oh, oh. All right, I think we scalped her a little. <laughs> this thing is not gonna last very long if I keep doing it like this. how good Danny is at backing up too. Look at that, he did it. Come on now. Do you want to know what smell I love? What? The smell of freshly worked ground. That's why I married you. Yeah, I thought so. 
Now we're going to need help deciding if we should plant field corn, sweet corn, or popcorn in here. I guess while they're over there, we're going to check on the little Kathy. Looks like she ate most of our grain. She has plenty of water and hay. Here she comes. Hey, wild one. She thinks she's getting more milk. Hi, little one. Hi there. We put her over here, like, in this shrubbery next to our house because our backyard gets so hot. We wanted her to have some shade. I don't know, those calf hutches get so hot when it's really hot outside. What's Nellie doing? She is a ball of fire. What happened? Uh, one of the tires blew. It would be fine, probably. I mean, for what little bit this is. I want to go see. Yeah, maybe I should just finish it. Because the tire's shot here. Anyway. I just don't want to move. Nelly. Now we can cultivate right down a straight line, right down through here to there. That'll be a lot better. Yeah. 